Spanish explorers discovered Florida in 1513. They returned with cattle in 1521. The early cattle raising days were very rough. The settlers fought India raids, mosquitoes, storms, swamps, and snakes. Did you know that Florida became an organized territory on March 30th, 1821? And we became a state March 3rd, 1845. Did you know that Florida's old time cowboys had a unique way of herding cattle? They used 10 to 12 foot long whips made of braided leather. Snapping these whips in the air made a loud crack. This earned them the nickname of the Florida Crackers. Did you know that our state nickname is the Sunshine State? The origin of our state name came from the Spanish word Pascua, Florida, meaning Feast of Flowers. Did you know that our Florida motto is in God we trust? Our state flower is the orange blossom. Did you know that our state bird is the mockingbird? Our state song is the Swanee River. Did you know that our state is 53,927 square miles? We have 67 counties, 31 state forests, which is 890,000 acres, 159 state parks, and our 2010 resident population was close to 19 million. Did you know that as of 2010, the 10 largest cities were Jacksonville, Miami, Tampa, St. Petersburg, Orlando, Hialeah, Tallahassee, Fort Lauderdale, Port St. Lucie, and Pembroke Pines. Did you know Florida had a record number of visitors in 2004 of 76.8 million, making the tourism industry have an economic impact of 57 billion on the Florida economy? Did you know that the production of fresh vegetables has been one of the state's valuable industries? Commercial shipments began in September and October and extends through the season. The heavy commercial vegetable areas of the state are in the central and south Florida districts. Florida stands first of all the states in shipments of snap beans, celery, and tomatoes. Did you know that other crops of the commercial importance are cabbage, cucumbers, peppers, eggplant, lettuce, and English peas? Did you know that watermelons are a very heavy commercial product, confined largely to central, north, and northwest sections of the state? The production of the watermelon seed is also an important industry of some of the North Florida counties, particularly Jefferson County. Did you know Florida citrus is second only to Brazil in the global industry for orange juice production? And Florida remains the world's leading producer of grapefruit. Did you know Florida produces more than 80% of the U.S. supply of citrus? More than 80% of Americans drink orange juice made from Florida-grown oranges. Did you know that the Spanish explorers turned Florida into America's oldest cattle raising state? By the 1800s, the Seminole Nation possessed extensive herds of cattle. Florida was an open range. There was not a fenced pasture anywhere. The early cowboys would round up cows over miles and miles of open plains and then drive them to market. With over 1.1 million head of beef cattle, Florida is the third largest beef producing state east of the Mississippi River and ranked 10th in the nation. Did you know how strawberries got their name? Their name came from the common practice of growing berries under straw to protect them from the winter cold. Did you know that Florida has 8,000 acres of berries? Growers plant bare root plants rather than seeds. Hillsborough County produces 15% of the nation's strawberries. Did you know that this commodity has an impact on our community exceeding $272 million? Did you know that the major varieties are Winterdawn, Festival, Camarosa, Treasure, Carmine? Do they all taste the same? No, but different varieties have different flavors. 
Did you know that Florida Aqua Farms produce products for food and non-food markets that include seafood, fish and shellfish, water gardening, bait, and biofuels? Did you know that aquaculture is an extraordinary diverse farming sector across the species? There are 1,500 species of fish, plants, mollusks, crustaceans, and reptiles grown. Did you know Florida's nursery and landscape crops are one of the largest agricultural commodities groups in Florida? Florida is a leading state, ranked second only to California in the nation in the production of greenhouses and nursery products. Florida's sales of hanging baskets and potted plants totaled $480 million in 2008. Did you know that the state of Florida has over 16 million acres of commercial forest land? This represents nearly half of the state's land. Did you know that Florida has 33 state forests and three national forests? Did you know that over 5,000 products that we use every day are made from trees? Did you know that each American uses the equivalent of one 100-foot tree every year? Did you know many different types of people around the world are working to help save the wetlands? The Common Sense Environmental Fund is raising money to help rebuild our wetlands in Florida. The Florida Everglades is the largest wetlands in the United States. 60 years ago, 1.7 billion gallons of fresh water were pumped into the ocean every day. Today, the largest restoration project in the world is saving the Florida Everglades. We all need wetlands. The wetlands help keep our water clean and control flooding. The wetlands are also the homes to many animals that are important to the food chain of all animals. Many laws have been made to help protect the wetlands. Now think about this question. What can we do around the world to help rebuild our wetlands? <laughs>